Y is a transformer rated in kVA and not in kilowatt. So before going into the deep discussion that word is given transformer. So what do you mean by transformer? Here the, this word has been made by the two things that is the transfer and the transformer. This transform is, is a device which transfer the power from one place to another place at a constant frequency means frequency should not get change means it should be constant then it is called the uh, transformer so the uh, the question uh, is given why is a transformer rated in kilovolt ampere and not in the kilowatt so transformers are rated in kilovolt ampere rather than in kilowatt because their primary purpose is to handle uh, the transformation of voltage levels while providing the electrical isolation. The distinction between the kilovolt ampere and kilowatt is crucial because transformer do not just change uh, the voltage they also affect the current and the power factor in a circuit so that is the reactive power reactive power the unit of reactive power is the kvar transformer not only change the voltage but can also affect the phase difference between the voltage and current leading to a power factor the reactive power that is measured in the kilo uh, kvar does not perform uh, useful work but is also for uh, maintaining the voltage levels and ensuring proper operation of the electrical system second one that is the inductive load handling Many loads connected to the transformer such as the motors, solenoids and fluorescent light are inductive in nature. These loads uh, draw reactive power and transformer needs to design to handle uh, both the active power that is real power that is measured in the kilowatt, uh, kilowatt and the reactive power kilovolt ampere accounts for both these components third one that is the power factor correction transformers can also be used for the power factor correction by adjusting the transformers tap setting or using the special configuration uh, utilities can also manage the reactive power flow and can improve the overall power factor of the system so we have discussed first one that is the uh, reactive power reactive power is denoted by the that is called the kvar k v a r next one we have discussed that is the uh, inductive load handling inductive load handling and third one that is the power factor correction